What's up guys, it's Osiris and welcome to another video in this Osin Audio series. Today we'll take a look at the Generate tab and we'll just look at other effects that we've not really talked about like silence, reverse, invert. And yeah, let's get right into this. Let's create a new track here. Then let's come over to the Generate tab. Then okay, let's start with this. So we have a sound here. In the morning, I can come over here and go to generate, click silence, and I can put in the amount of time I want to generate silence for. So I can put in two seconds, and it's just going to insert two seconds of silence within that. Until we greet the morning. Until the sun will rise. That's what generate silence does. So let's look at noise. So you can create noise, you can create black noise. Black noise is silence. Let's preview that. You can create white noise. You can create pink noise. can create brown noise then you can just set the intensity that's how loud it is and the amount of time the duration you want to insert this noise in the audio so i'm just going to insert five seconds of brown noise then this is just the distribution so the distribution changes how it sounds yeah, so let's insert this. Then we insert. Then let's preview this. Let's play this. So that's the noise tab in Ocean Audio. Let's take a look at generating tones. So we can generate four different tones. We can generate a sine wave, a triangle wave, a square wave, and a saw wave. So let's preview this. So that's a sine wave moving from 1 hertz to 11,000 hertz. So we can just create a sine wave that stays at, let's see, 500 hertz. And we can use that to create like a bass sound. Let's preview this. Okay. 200 let's do 100 yeah so that's like a bass sound so you can make your wave move move around from a particular frequency to a particular frequency so let's preview this it's moving from 100 to 16,000 then we can make it move from 17, 16,000 to, let's see, 200. This is just the duration and this is the intensity. So we can do that for any other type of waveform. Let's set this to a static position. So that's a square wave. It's a triangular wave. And this is a saw wave. Let's add in a sine wave for three seconds and let's see how that sounds. You can also generate dial codes. You know on phones when you dial a code, so you can generate the sound of those codes. Let's put in 911. So let's preview that. Let's put in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 
So let's say you're recording something and you want to generate a sound of you calling someone. You can use this to generate a dial tone. So let's put this in. And let's preview this. So that's the generate tab in Ocean Audio. Then let's look at the let's look at reverse. So reverse reverses a sound, flips a sound horizontally, so it reverses a sound backwards. I'll until the sun will rise. Let's reverse that. That's what the reverse does. Let's look at invert. So reverse flips um, horizontally and invert flips vertically. So that's face inversion. If you have um, two similar sounds and you invert them, let's see, let me show you something. So I have this sound here. I'll wait until we greet the morning. Then I can flip this upside down. Until we greet the morning. If I have this track here, and I have this track here, and if I flip this, flip this vertically, they are going to cancel out each other. Oh, didn't they didn't cancel out each other because they are the same sound. So I'm just going to make this unique. If I flip this vertically, they are going to cancel out each other. I'll wait until we greet the morning. Let's flip this normal, make this normal. So you can't hear anything because one is flipped upside down and one is in the right way. That's um, phase inversion in audio. So we've looked at the generate tab and we've looked into some other effects you can use while editing audio in Ocean Audio. And That'll be all for today, guys. Hope you learned something from this and hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions about this, leave them in the comments below. Turn on that notification bell so you can get a notification when I upload a video. Until next time, guys. Peace.